As technology continues to progress at an astonishing rate, we're beginning to achieve things that have previously only existed in the imaginations of science fiction writers. Here are 10 things that you can find in the real world right now, instead of having to watch Star Wars or Star Trek or Star anything. Amazing! Number 10. Robot Snipers If you're into video games at all, then at some point you've surely encountered an automated sentry turret. Unlike another player, it doesn't have to worry about aim, reaction time, or anything like that. Only pure death on sight. If you've always wanted to experience this sort of fun in real life, just take a trip to the Gaza Strip, where the Israeli Defense Force is working towards making this a reality. Parts of the controversial area are patrolled by remote-controlled .5 caliber machine guns that detect intruders via ground sensors and drones. Pillboxes containing the guns are interspersed every several hundred meters. Currently, a human being is still in the loop. A soldier back at command must authorize the gun to fire, although he isn't responsible for aiming, detecting, or anything else. However, they are working towards cutting off humans entirely and making them fully autonomous. Number 9. Self-Steering Bullets Bullets are a pretty effective way of killing someone, but there's always the problem of actually having to hit them. Bullets have had basically the same technology for practically a century, but DARPA is looking to change that. Since we're going to have self-driving cars here pretty soon, why not some self-driving bullets? DARPA's Extreme Accuracy Task Ordnance, or Exacto Bullet, can course correct itself after it's been fired. Because the weapon is top secret classified information, nobody knows exactly how the bullet actually works. But Sandia National Labs has a similar self-guiding bullet that makes use of tiny fins and others speculate that the bullet has some way of altering its center of mass. Elsewhere, a Texas-based startup called Tracking Point is developing a scope capable of enabling anyone to accurately hit targets up to 1,400 yards away. This is done with their precision-guided system, which includes a networked tracking scope. It is able to track a target, calculate range, and the ballistic solution depending on wind speed, the dropping of the bullet due to gravity, and other factors. It places a crosshair into the scope and shoots as soon as you line it up on the target. This eliminates the threat of timing errors and prevents trigger squeeze from messing up the shot. It's pretty much aimbot in real life. Number 8. Tractor Beams What spacey science fiction movie is truly complete without the tractor beam? An invisible arm of some kind that can be turned on with the flip of a switch and pull in our unwitting main characters. And it wasn't invented by George Lucas. Fictional villains have been using these things since the campy space adventure books of the 1930s. The reason for this is that scientists have known for a long time that light really does emit pressure and that it can move small particles. NASA is currently researching three different possible methods. One that would be a sort of light tweezers, grabbing the object from either side, a spiraling tunnel of laser waves, and a Bessel beam, which is so advanced it can't even be explained with a physical metaphor. Currently. NASA can only move microscopic particles with these tractor beams, but it's a tractor beam nonetheless, and by 2050, they'll likely be pulling in enemy alien spaceships. Number 7. Freeze Ray Mr. Freeze, Frozone, and May would truly be proud of the German scientists who, by aiming lasers at high-pressure gas, were able to lower temperatures by 119 degrees in only a few seconds taking humanity's first and giant step towards creating a freeze ray. And it's not something that can just be performed in a lab under certain conditions. A research team in Berlin actually managed to use the technology to create clouds in the sky by rapidly cooling down water vapor. Scientists may claim that the intended use of this technology would be to create clouds for farmers whose crops are in need of rain, but everyone knows that their real secret goal is to be able to turn people into blocks of ice with the push of a button and become supervillains who make lots of bad, cold-related puns. Number 6. Infantry Robots Science fiction has long predicted that eventually war isn't going to be about people fighting people, but about robots fighting people. But how close are we to moving away from stormtroopers and finally getting into battle droids? Possibly closer than you might think. The US military's Modular Advanced Armed Robotic System, or MARS, is a robot designed for reconnaissance, surveillance, and target acquisition. The 370-pound robot can be equipped with an M240B machine gun with 450 rounds of ammo, as well as four M203 grenade launcher tube. The MARS can travel at 7 miles per hour, 
about human jogging speed and be up to 1,000 meters away from its human controller. Needless to say, most people would rather be the person pushing the Mars joystick than have to go kick down a terrace door the old-fashioned way. Number 5. A Heat Ray for science fiction scenarios when shooting someone just isn't going to cut it, a heat ray is a great way of letting everyone know you mean business by melting their face off, or maybe just setting them on fire. For all your long-range heating needs, look no further than the Active Denial System, or ADS. The U.S. military created ADS for area denial, perimeter security, and crowd control, so non-lethal tasks rather than face melting, but impressive nonetheless. The weapon works by shooting 95 gigahertz waves at the target, which doesn't sound too threatening until you realize that a microwave oven is only 2.45 gigahertz and can still make stuff painful to put in your mouth. The ADS excites water and fat molecules under people's skin, causing them to experience intense heat. A test subject described his experience with getting hit with a beam like this. For the first millisecond, it just felt like the skin was warming up, then it got warmer and warmer, and you felt like it was on fire. As soon as you're away from the beam, your skin returns to normal, and there is no pain. Number 4. Shockwave Cannon If a heat ray seems too overtly villainous for your non-lethal crowd control needs, perhaps you would be better off trying the aptly named Thunder Generator. Originally used by Israeli farmers to scare birds away, because apparently scarecrows weren't cutting it, the Israeli military realized the technology's broader potential. Igor Friedman, the president of the company that created the system, says that anyone within 30 to 50 meters from the cannon will feel like he's standing in front of a firing squad, but won't be hurled to the ground. He'll be able to run away unharmed. The cannon creates these non-lethal blasts by pumping a mixture of liquefied petroleum, cooking gas, and air through the barrel, where they detonate, ultimately creating a series of high-velocity shock bursts. Number 3. A Sound Gun The Long Range Acoustic Device, or LRAD, is a weapon system that finally brings the powers of a whole myriad of superheroes as well as Overwatch's Lucio into reality. LRAD fires narrow beams of sound that can be heard by the naked ear a thousand feet away, plenty of distance to warn possible intruders that they should stay away before you unleash your futuristic technology on them. Because at full power, LRAD can also create sounds so loud that anyone hearing it would be forced to run away. The sound is so concentrated, however, that those using LRAD wouldn't be affected themselves. The system has been used to repel pirates off the northeast coast of Somalia and deter protesters at the 2009 G20 summit in Pittsburgh. Number 2. Laser Cannon In a lot of science fiction, Bullets are nowhere to be found, as everyone knows that lasers that can effortlessly slice through anything are far superior and make cooler pew-pew sounds. We may not have handled blasters yet, but we do have a full-on laser cannon, the Laser Avenger. The Hummer-mounted laser is capable of shooting a drone straight out of the sky with nothing but a highly concentrated laser beam. And that was only one kilowatt. Northrop Grumman, the company responsible for creating Laser Avenger, is working on a 100 kilowatt beam that would be capable of far more damage. But taking down aircrafts isn't the system's only function. It can also be used to remotely and safely detonate IEDs. The US military's collection of sci-fi weaponry will also soon include the Mach 6 EM railgun, recently test-fired in Virginia. The cannon, created for use onboard battleships, launches projectiles with powerful electromagnetism. Number 1. Iron Man Suit We'll probably never have a real-life Superman, Thor, or Hulk, but Iron Man, to quote Captain America in the first Avengers movie, is just a big man in a suit of armor. That sounds a lot more achievable than finding an alien who's strong enough to tow the Earth. Or at least, that's what the U.S. military must have thought when they began developing the Tactical Assault Light Operator Suit, or Talos. While it might not be able to fly, the planned features are pretty superhuman. A mechanical exoskeleton would allow the user to lift far more than your average soldier, effectively giving them super strength. Scientists say that the suit, which the military hopes to have working prototypes of in 2018, would also feature liquid armor that would solidify in milliseconds to be able to stop a bullet while still being light enough to wear. What other sci-fi technology do you think will really exist soon? Is there anything that you hope never makes its way into our world? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. 
Also, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a like and click that bell icon to be notified next time we post a new video. Thanks for watching.